What's up guys, this is Rare Music and welcome back to Robot Ops 4. So yeah guys, Reaper is back in Black Ops 4. He's actually a multiplayer this time, not just Blackout. He went from a pointless skin to just being recycled from Black Ops 3. As we all know, Black Ops 4 takes up a lot of space on PlayStation and Xbox every time they have like an update. So if you guys didn't know this, if you have Black Ops 3 installed, Black Ops 4 won't take up as much space because there's so much content being recycled from that game. <laughs> nah, I'm kidding. But yeah, Reaper is back in Black Ops 4. He has like a radar shroud special ability and the scythe, except it's no longer like this robot arm that shoots a machine gun. It's a double barrel 50 cal machine gun. And if you check out his skins, you have, uh, well, just one. Wait, what happened? There was a second one. They got rid of it. It was actually exactly the same as this one, though, which was completely pointless. He also has no war paints, so good job, Vondi. But today's video is actually going to be about the new crossbow that was added to Black Ops 4. If you guys didn't hear in the last video that I made, I was out in Fiji for two weeks and I completely missed like the whole extra update where you could get an ultra weapon bribe. I think you had to climb roughly 15 tiers to be able to get the weapon bribe, and I got it, but I had to grind so much. And as I'm sure you can tell by the title of this video, guess what I got from my ultra weapon bribe? <laughs> I got the Argus. I'm most likely going to be making a separate video about the Argus. So if you guys want to see that, make sure to drop a like. <laughs> oh my god, what has happened? Not but seriously, I'm going to make a separate video about the Argus. Today's going to be about the crossbow, and it's because Vonderspoink has added sticks and stones into Black Ops 4. I wasn't lucky enough to get it from the Ultra Weapon Bribe. I haven't gotten it from a reserve case. And unfortunately, you can't get it from the stream, so you can't really earn it for free, which once again is a bummer, but you know, that's Black Ops 4. So yeah, today we're going to be playing some sticks and stones. We can actually use the crossbow for the first time. I haven't used it at all. Right off the bat, it's kind of stupid because you can't play with a party. It's supposed to be a party game, but you can only play it solo which makes no sense. Another staple of Black Ops 4, just not making any sense. I actually really like the fact that they brought back grind from Black Ops 2. This is probably just gonna be a free win. I have no idea. I haven't even played Six and Stones in this game. Oh, okay, we got the crossbow. Look at that. Didn't have to open up a single supply drop. It's called the Reaver C86. Let's inspect it. Let's give it a good look. Yep, pretty sure that's the crossbow. Now let's go use it. Eh! Oh, one shot, really? Wow, that's sad. Okay. But yeah, don't make your mom and dad go broke by trying to get supply drop weapons. Just play Six and Stones, you can get the crossbow, and you can get the ballistic knife. I don't have either of these, but they put Six and Stones in the game, so you can just use it there. Oh my, I missed again. Is it explosive? I can't tell. Oh my. I think it's explosive. Oh, there's a kill. I... How many shots? Whoa! Alright. Can I pick up the shots? That's kind of... You can't pick up your ballistic knife shots? That's just depressing. Oh my god. Wait. There we go. Why is it so difficult to scavenge ballistic knife shots? This is stupid. Let's just see the explosion of the crossbow. Okay. Six and stones is already kind of weird in this game. I cannot hit the crossbow shots to save my life. Uh oh. There we go. There we go. Come on. Oh, okay. I got stuck. How come the crossbow and the kill feed looks like the tax shotgun from Fortnite? What, what is that? Oh, Black Ops 4. Continuing to be such a lazy game. Can I actually hit a crossbow shot? There we go. Got his toe. He it reads. I am a robot. I am a killing machine. Look at me go. I killed the door. Get spawn trapped, kid. I am smarter than you and better at video games. Only need 110 points to win. Robot must not lose. Programming will explode. It's reset. Now! I'm not going to win! Ah, what did I get? I got second place. I joined late. <laughs> not bad. 2.75 KD. Oh, no. This is the play. Let's see how many kills he gets. What do you do? One. Everyone's just trying to pick up more stuff and they can't. Give us like Nuketown or something. I could actually hit a feed. Uh, Morocco, gross. No, thank you. I got a reserve case. Let's open it up. I want to know what's in that case as much as you do. <laughs> Give me my common stickers. I need a common sticker, common sticker, common. Come on, dude. That looks so ugly. Why does he look like he's in pain from having them wear this war paint thing? Who smeared this shit? Oh my face. Let's go play some more Sticks and Stones. I miss the original announcer. I don't even know if it's the same announcer. I think it's just the Black Ops 4 one. Sticks and Stones. Sticks and Stones. <laughs> What am I doing? I got a whopping one kill with the crossbow, so I don't even know if it's good or not. There's also three new multiplayer maps. You have Der Schotten, which that, wow. I got to go take a Der Schotten in the toilet, failure. And then you have Remnant and Havana from Black Ops 1. I want to actually play the new maps. Oh, I should go for the bang shot thing. I can get two reserve cases. <gasps> we got Der Schotten. I'm going to Der Shot all over you noobs. Who came up with this map name? Like, seriously. Is there a German employee at Treyarch that's like, I need to take a sh I'm going to drop a Der Schotten now. <laughs> this game, dude. I don't have the map. Why do they not auto download, dude? What is wrong with this game? I couldn't take it, they're shot now. So upset. Take me to the store. Oh, you have to go to the MP Max thing for then download I hate how this game works. <laughs> I think I just get them automatically, right? I don't understand why you have to go to the store and actually manually download the maps. I think I actually got the Der Schotten lobby. But yeah, you don't actually download anything when you go to the store and download it. It's like an on or off switch for the DLC. It's stupid. This map looks a little spooky so far. Looks like the frozen forest. 
There we go, stuck him. What I'm curious to know from you guys is whether this new crossbow is more like the crossbow in Black Ops 2 or if it's more like the one in Black Ops 3. The Black Ops 2 crossbow is really not all that good, and I think that's exactly what this is. In Black Ops 2, you really couldn't get too many attachments that would make it that powerful. But in Black Ops 3, the Shadow Claw was actually kind of OP. You could get a bayonet attached to the end of it, or you could make it go akimbo, which is what really made it shine. I want to blow him up. Can I... The explosion does like nothing. Oh. Enemy data. Downloading enemy data. Oh, you can actually see the person. They show up as gold on the map. Haha. <laughs> Oh, why am I not picking up the tomahawk faster? Come on! In the corner. Are you door shitting me? <laughs> Camping in the corner. Hello, I didn't realize you're behind me. He just tried to 360 me? What is happening? I don't think you can scavenge your own shots. I think you can only scavenge the enemy shots. I don't know if I really like this version of it all that much. Stop camping. I'm gonna try to go for that bank shot though so I can get two reserve cases. Hey man. Get back here, please. Can, can you please just get back here so I can kill you, please? Thank you. Where is he going? Scanning enemy positions. Up oh, here's a dude camping. <laughs> well, that's two reserve cases, and you lost your first place. <laughs> I am the best sticks and stones player ever. I'm in first place. Wait, then. Oh, I'm in first place now. They're, they're gonna try to demote me. I've just gotta cap and look at my butter knife. Get away. Ah! What I still think is kind of weird about Six and Stones is that there's really no stakes for playing the mode. Like in Black Ops 1 when you were doing wager matches, you were actually wagering up your COD points. Which in Black Ops 1 you could use that to get camos, especially gold camo. It'd be kind of cool if you got first place at Six and Stones and got a reserve crate or something. But you know they're not gonna do that. But yeah, I just won my first game of Six and Stones. Wait, what? Eh? It said I was in first! What? I had the most points. Oh. Wait, what? No, I had it. I had most points at the end too. What is going on? This makes no sense. Oh, Remnant, I can play that map. I haven't played that one either. One thing I've also noticed ever since the Operation Apocalypse C update is that for some reason it takes forever to climb the tiers. I've been playing a lot since the update and I'm only tier five. And when you get to tier 40, you get another ultra weapon bribe, which means I could have a chance of getting the crossbow for real. But yeah, if you have the crossbow in Black Ops 4 and you're watching this video, let me know what you think about it. Can you actually get some good attachments for it? Does it even have like an operator mod? Or is it just pointless garbage? Oh, we got an alligator. It's the Swampy Skipper's souvenir shop. I'm just admiring this map right now. Wait. Can you teleport? You, you can actually teleport? Yo, that is sick. Wait, for real? I can't tell if I actually teleported or not or if it just turned me around. You can! What? That's ridiculous. That's actually really cool. So it's the Museum of Unnatural History. When I saw the first preview of this map, I thought it actually looked like an infinite warfare map. Ooh, pick it up. I think it was this part of the map that made it look like Infinite Warfare. I don't even remember the name of the map in Infinite Warfare. It was the DLC one. It was the one that had the art gallery in the middle. I think it had a shark too. Oh my god, it has the transit bus, dude. Yeah, that's pretty cool. These maps are actually kind of neat. Not bad for an organic. Not bad for an organic. Gear it. Oh. Oh, I got shot in the head. But yeah, I actually dig this map. It's pretty cool. Looks like it's got a lot of Easter eggs on it. <gasps> it's a dog in a spaceship outfit. Was that a sentence? Oh yes, let's go swim. Sw swim in the swamp. I'm wordsing very well. I don't know if you need to aim with the crossbow or not. This thing's so weird. Hello. Oh, I suck him too. Okay. Yeah, maybe you don't need to aim with a crossbow. It's hard to tell. Unless it's at long range. No. Oh, got him. Stop camping, robot. You are a fool. You cannot swim in water because you are a robot. You will malfunction and die, sadly. All hail David von der Haar. If you praise him, you will get better supply drops. Wait, what? There's a zombie! Ew! I killed it. Ah! And I got humiliated. I just lost all my points. Well, that was, that was good. This is actually a pretty cool map, though. It is a pretty big map, though. I have a feeling it'll play out pretty terribly in actual game modes, but at least it looks like they put some time and effort into this one. Actually, come to think about it, it takes forever, like, to actually find people on this. I don't like it that much. Oh, got him in the knee. Come on, gotta win this last second. Come on, let's bankrupt. First place. Oh, was that it? It wasn't! Random throw! Well, I didn't even get that. Uh, I didn't even place top three that one. Oh, well. <laughs> I literally lost that because I was just shooting a zombie that's part of the map. Artifact. Oh, God. What's the deal with these giant Stonehaven maps? Get them out of here. Put me on Nuketown. Jungle. <gasps> I can go for trick shots on jungle. I actually kind of want to do that. That'd be fun. Here we go. Time to hit some trick shots. Time to hit trick shot. Must enter phase clan. Prepare for montage clip. I'm going to do this. I already spa it spawned me right here. It knows. Wait. How do people actually play on this sensitivity? What? Oh, God. Don't kill me, Torque. I must go to the top and hit my trick shot. Yo, 14 sensitivity is crazy. And ah! Well, okay. I just want to hit a doinky, dude. Stop spoiling my fun. <gasps> Here it comes. I got him. <laughs> dude, it is hard to actually trick shot. Oh my god. The two piece. Nope. Imagine if it actually. I want to see what I look like. How stupid do I look? Just giant robot. Okay, well, he was up there. He couldn't see me. <laughs> oh my god. Get away. Oh, how did I actually kill anyone? <laughs> this is actually legitimately hard. The two piece. 
We tomahawk him. All right, we jump down and reload. See, like, how do you hit anything? I, I don't understand. I used to actually do this in Black Ops 1. Like, I made some terrible montages. I think I made a wager match montage. It was called Gombler. I know I just tried to hit feats and trick shots in, like, wager matches. It was ridiculous. Some of the clips were actually pretty cool, but the standards weren't really all that high. Oh, my God. Why am I even talking about this? <laughs> I hope no one watches it. Boom! That should hit someone, right? Yeah. Like, imagine just doing this and being like, Oh, my God! That was so on! I gotta see this. What does this look like? I must look so stupid. <laughs> I am a trick shotting machine. You must bow down to report. I will eventually put you in my montage. It will get many views. Humiliation. Come on. I got humiliated. I must be sent back to the factory to get fixed. Cross map. I didn't hit anyone. I must do the spinny thingy and get killed. Never mind. Did I just get, he killed, he blew himself up. Is that a humiliation? He, that was a humiliation. Oh my God. I think he's raging in game chat. <gasps> I actually got a hit marker. I got a hit marker. <laughs> I can't aim anything. <laughs> How do you play on max sensitivity? I don't even into understanding. Come on, I can't even hit a bad trick shot. Cross map. That'll eventually hit someone, I swear. Oh, this is where it lands? What? It could almost hit someone up there. Oh, okay, it's over. Time to put my sensitivity back to a normal person. But I think I'm gonna call it there. Thank you guys very much for watching. I hope you guys enjoyed watching me use the new crossbow and sticks and stones on Black Ops 4. If you guys did and you wanna see me use the new Argoose in Black Ops 4, make sure to drop a like and I'll see you guys later.